U.S. President-elect Donald Trump has selected Robert F. Kennedy Jr., who has spread misinformation about vaccines, to become his health secretary. Well, our U.S. correspondent James Matthews is in Washington for us. Uh, James, a controversial choice, to say the least. Yeah, the most controversial since the last one, actually, Barbara, but possibly more so. RFK Jr., well-known, he's part of the Kennedy dynasty, son of Bobby Kennedy, nephew of JFK. Now, this is an individual with no medical training. Uh, he's an environmental lawyer, and yet he's been put in the position overseeing health, food, medicine in this country. He ran in the election but stepped out, ran as an independent, uh, stepped out and backed Donald Trump. This is the kickback uh, for him. It has caused uh, consternation amongst politicians, certainly opposition politicians, but also in the public health arena. This is an individual who is a conspiracy theorist, anti-vaxxer. He has said that vaccines are unproven and dangerous in the past, said in the past that HIV didn't cause, they, cause AIDS. So you have this individual uh, who contradicts many of the established medical practices in this country. And of course, ultimately, it's a matter of life and death in terms of the medical treatment that people are given in the United States. Donald Trump uh, is ignoring criticism. He seems happy, has posted on X for too long. Americans have been crushed by the industrial food complex and drug companies who've engaged in deception misinformation and disinformation, he says, when it comes to public health. So Donald Trump quite content, but I can tell you many on this side of the Atlantic are not. RFK Jr., in common with the other controversial appointments, has yet to be confirmed, of course, by the Senate. That's by no means a given. Yeah, and lots more appointments still to come, of course. James Matthews with the latest from Washington. Thank you.